seen this video that means you have come to see my collective holiday haul just to let you guys know as a disclaimer nothing i've showed you has been bought all in one go i'm not balling like that and i'm very sensible these days when it comes to spending these were all accumulated over the last two and a half months or so first thing i'm going to show you guys is from tk max this is luggage and it's from london fog i do have london fog suitcases i love this stuff and it's an under seat bag so this is what it looks like it's got pockets on both sides it's got a zipper here at the top and then it's got another zipper and it's got these um leather straps or pleather straps and it's got a pull up handle so you could wheel it it's got four wheels no two wheels sorry guys and it also has the little thing on the back here so you could strap it onto your other suitcase makes it easy for traveling you guys know it's just me and kaylan who's going on holiday and it has the little thing here to clasp it i feel like i'm doing a bag haul but i just want you guys to see and then you've got your two two little side bits here for stuff so i'm going to check the side bits to see if i've popped anything in it and i haven't and you could use these for shoes actually flat sandals and the other side is pretty much the same except this one's got a clear bit and a net and i'm sure this one had what two nets this had two nets so we're going to open it up and get into it there are some stuff in here so i'll just show you guys and this is from the paddington collection for those of you who are interested like i said london fog this is not a sponsored video but they do quite a lot of nice luggages okay if you want to invest in your luggage then london fog is the way to go now you've got your little clear pouches here so you could put your toothbrush toothpaste obviously travel size things guys because if it's over 100 mils they're gonna dash it so just put stuff just in case you don't get your luggage you obviously if you've traveled or you're a frequent traveler you'll know always have extra knickers whatever it is that you need so in case you don't get your bags as soon as you come off your flight Let's tilt it down a bit more so you could see it's quite deep. So I had quite a bit in it. And then you've got other pouches here and a laptop sleeve or a tablet sleeve right here. So if we zip this down, you can see it's quite deep. It's got the London Ferg tagging in there so you know it's authentic. And this I picked up from TK Maxx. It was under £40. This would be stocking a few of Kayla's snacks. Obviously, we're not allowed to carry liquids. So there would be no liquids until we get through all of that security bit. And then we buy what we need in the actual waiting area. I'll be packing this with a change of clothes or two for Kayla because he'll be potty training. Change of nappies, few snacks, his tablet my laptop I pack them all in here i don't think they'll weigh this you've got another zipper here so you could put stuff that easily accessible down in there i picked up this lovely gorgeous backpack i did have a similar backpack like this from primer not the same style or anything but i returned it because it broke and i was just like i usually would dash it and i was just like you know what manufacturing fault i ain't keeping it and i took it back and i got my money back but this one was 19.99. You guys can see that. Okay. But it retails for 55 quid. The material is really nice. And the reason why I went for a backpack is because it could fit my blue wallet in it. And it could fit all of my travel documents. And just as a demo, I've got like my wallet, just a dummy phone here. And it works, but it's not the phone I'm currently using. And I've got my travel document holder. Now, this is not from TK Maxx. I'm just going to show you guys. I bought this because it's just one travel video, isn't it? So you're going to see luggage, clothes, everything in here. So I bought this from Amazon and it's by the brand Deathway. Okay. And this is what it looks like. It's got a removable wrist, wrist thing. Woo. Sorry. 
and it's got that um blocker on it i forgot what it's called it's got the refill blocker so nobody could scan your card and this is what it looks like so you've got a little pouch here like i said i've got the dummy phone obviously the phone is in a case but you could put your phone in the bed you don't want to be searching for your phone in the airport you've got four passport pouches um my passport's in the other room so you put your passports let me get my passports hold on okay so i've got my passports here and i've got my other documents that i'm taking so in this i've got some euros from last year if you guys are old subscribers you know we went to france for my friend's wedding and that very same friend is the person i'm going to be staying with on my holiday i'm going to show you guys how i'm going to be utilizing this document holder because i like to be pretty organized if you know me i don't want to be in the airport with a toddler going through things and can't find in this and not having another adult with me to you know sort of help or support me so you've got the phone in here okay you don't have to put a phone in here you could put your boarding pass and i think that's what i would actually do but i'm just doing it as a demo we've got passport one so you've got your two passports here you could also use the back pouch there because it's deep enough for your boarding pass as well you've got a little zip here that you could put your currency your local currency for where you're going in and then if you're going to be traveling with a credit card so what I'm going to do, I'm taking my normal wallet, guys. I feel like this is going to be a long-winded video. But this is kind of like a, chat, a travel haul, sit-down chat with me video, okay? I'm going to be taking this to France, but I'm not going to be walking with it everywhere. So what I will do, I will take, if there's a card that I could use abroad, which would be my bank card, because my bank has got this offer here, I could use the card up until the end of August there. So if anything, and I don't want to use cash, and I feel, okay, I need something, and I don't want to use my cash, I'll use the card. I'll put the card in here. So you'll see they've got little credit card pouches. And I'll also put my driver's license for ID purposes. And I don't think I'll be walking with our passports either around when I'm out and around in France. Because they, they're pickpockets there. Pickpockets are everywhere, but yeah. And then you've got the key holder, which is detachable. So this is what it looks like. You just press that and it comes off this looks like a promotional video and you could put your coins into the little zip part right here so it's perfect guys when um we're traveling together as a family of three or four we've got more space for everybody's passport because last time i held everything for everyone now the other documents i'll be putting into it i've got my european health insurance card obviously i don't want you guys to see our information so we've got our european health insurance card i will also be putting my travel insurance into this so while i'm doing this video why not just take it off oops okay this is one for me one for kaylan obviously and i'll pop them into the little card slots so you've got one there one there the other thing we've got, we've got our travel itinerary, which is here. We've also got our bus ticket. We've got copies of our passport, one of Kayla and one of mine. And I will actually walk with these copies in here. When I get to France, get to my friends, I'll take all of the documents out, the documents that people could take. I'll take them out and I'll keep the copies. I'll walk with the copies of the passport in here so in case anybody tried to take anything i've not lost the original stuff you know i mean god forbid nobody does that but you never know i'm going to make copies of my driver's license as well and i'm going to put it into um this but i'll also work with the original because some places are a bit funny with copies so that's how we're going to be using this lovely little wristlet travel document holder all of these i'll fold them a bit smaller and they'll go into here with that long-winded bit over I wanted to show you guys the bag. Okay, so this is the bag. I could put my phone in here, my lip gloss or whatever, a small hand cream, whatever it is. And it fits my wallet, which is this perfectly. Like I said, I would not be walking with this out and about. And it also fits my document holder. Now, the reason why I have got a backpack, like I said, I've got a toddler. See, it's all nice nicely in i've got a toddler and i don't want to be rummaging through no handbag or nothing a side bag is perfect as well but sometimes those could be a bit heavy i do have one that i took last year but i don't know if i'll be carrying that i'll probably just stick to this and just carry this 
Um, so everywhere you see me, you'll be seeing me with this. I won't have no other kind of bag except this because I like to have everything together. So that's that. That's, that's the demo. It's got a zipper. Whoa. It's got a zipper on the inside, guys. So it's got a zipper here and a little pouch. A little pouch at the back of the zipper. And then on the other side here, it's dark so you can't really see. You've got your phone holders or whatever else you want to put in here, there. And you've got a zipper on the back as well. So if you are on a bar and you have your card, I would put your card in this bit. Because this bit would be directly on your back and they won't know it's there. It's sort of like a little secret zip. So they won't really know it's there if it's on your back. The other item I got to make travel easier for me and my son, I got the luggage strap, six foot web strap. And this is the brand. And I picked this up in TK Maxx for £2.99. And this is to strap Kaylan's car seat onto the actual big suitcase. So it's easy to carry around because I'm going to have a car seat. I'm going to have a pram. I don't necessarily need to have a pram, but I'm going to take the pram because if we're going to be walking, I'm not carrying him. Nope, nope, nope. We leave on Sunday. So we leave here early, early Sunday morning. We leave Leicester early Sunday morning. So everything needs to be packed before the weekend. And I'm a, I'm a procrastinator, God forbid. Anyway, TK Maxx, I picked up this um, set of two silicone brush cleaning finger gloves. And I've got one in the bathroom that I've used already and this is what it looks like. It's perfect for traveling to clean my makeup brushes. I would not be taking a lot of makeup brushes or makeup. The last time I went, I took my whole makeup and it's just like, it's too much. I can't be bothered. Um, so that's what that looks like. And I paid $4.99 for that. And then I've got the Face Dewer Set, which is this silicone sort of exfoliating um, face thing. And then you've got the extractor right there. I think that's all I got from TK Maxx. Now, when I was in Lidl, I saw these and I don't even think I had booked a holiday. I didn't book a holiday and I saw these and I thought, oh, these are cute. And they are little travel, travel size containers. So you've got two sizes. I've got the little small ones. And I've got these ones, okay? And you could actually suck them on. If you're in a hotel, right, and you want to get fancy and unpack. Sorry, I'll just, it's kind of stuck. You just stick them onto the tile. They've got a suction. And you just stick them on with your cream. And it has, you could change this. So you could change this from sun lotion to like cream. You could change this from conditioner to shampoo. And you could change that from lotion to something else. And I like that, you know, like you see the little things, you could actually change them. And I thought that was quite handy. And I know these would last a long, long time. So I picked these up in little. I don't remember the price. And I also picked up, you know, the kids' plasters. So we could take these as well. Like I said, we I didn't know we were going to travel. I was quite impulsive when I booked my ticket. But those came in really, really handy. These are going to be in no particular order because I've got bare things here to show you guys okay so i've showed you guys the travel document holders and all that good stuff i will then show you guys i got some travel wipes so i will carry these in our check luggage um and i'll carry one in our carry-on obviously because these come in handy we got that then i picked up some and that's from aldi and i picked up some blending sponges which are from Aldi as well. I've not tried them yet, but I will take one with me on holiday. Let you guys know how they work. I got these trousers. Okay, let me show you the ones I got originally. I picked up the M&S ones. These are the M&S ones, okay? Stripe and the blue anchor thing. And these were 10 quid. Now, I don't mind paying 10 quid for swimming trunks, okay? They're 10 pounds. They weren't on sale. But I went to Tesco and I saw these ones yesterday. Same size. 18 to 24 months because Kaylan is small and your swimming trunks are not supposed to be big. They were £3.50 on sale. So I'm going to take the M&S ones back and get my £10 back, obviously. And I'm going to keep the Tesco ones, which are just a light blue and a dark blue one. And he doesn't need more than two. And then for Kaylan, these are going to be mixed, okay? So you're going to see Kaylan and my stuff mixed. I got him a three pack of t-shirts with um, PJ Masks. He loves PJ Masks. 
and these were 6 50 and I think the price was originally £10. So it's £6.50 on sale and you get three t-shirts, perfect for holiday. So you've got this one here. And then you've got this one. And then the back one is this one. And he loves PJ Masks. And my friend was with me. I had taken it up, but it was only two on the hanger. I didn't realise it was a three-pack. And when she searched through, she said, oh, it's a three-pack. And she read the thing. And I was like, you know what, thank God that you were here because I would have bought the two-pack thing thinking it's, you know, the right thing. So we've got two, that's three shirts for Kaylan to take on a holiday. Now, Kaylan has a lot of clothes, guys. A lot. I always tell you guys that. He has a lot of clothes, so I don't need, really need to buy him no jeans or nothing. The only thing I might need to buy him is a pair of sandals. And that's if it's pushing. I also got him these from Morrison's. I love the little um, birdie on it. How it's like so squishy. It's actually oh so cute. And this was £3.50. And this is from Morrison's. If you guys don't know, Morrison sells clothes. And I got him this other one that says limited edition. And this was £2.50 from Morrison's. For myself, in Tesco, I picked up this swimsuit here, okay, it's an all-in-one swimsuit, I like it, I like the little cutout bits here, if you could see, my fingers could fit through it, it's got a little cutout bit, um, it's really, really cute, but I don't like how I look in it, um, this is a size 12, because you know your swimsuits, you, you get them smaller, I think a size 14 would have fit, but would have been a bit big on the boobs, I'm not heavy chested, so I'm going to be returning these. This was on sale for £11. This is the other one. Which I also like. It has a little cutter at the boob bit. But I don't like how it fits. And um, obviously I tried this on with knickers guys. You have to be sanitary. And it's got the little plastics on both of them. Don't be carrying home swimsuits and trying them on with your dotty crotch. Yeah? That's not hygienic. Went into New Look to get a few bits. I've got a New Look store card. And my store card, I've got a small limit. I refuse to get more on it. It's only £100 and I'm fine with that. With New Look, if you spend £50, it's interest free for three months. But I usually pay off right away anyway. Um, I'm using it to build my credit. But that's a whole different video. I'm talking too much. I picked up this top. I love the way it looks. It's a ribbed top. And I love, love the way it looks on. I love the colour on my skin. And I didn't want to pay $9.99 for a top. I got these jeans. Let me tell you about these jeans. These India jeans. <gasps> they fit like a glove. Guys, these are like super skinny as well. So if you want to go and you look and find them, that's it. They're India super skinny. I love the wash and I love the way they look. These go perfect together. I'm going to give you guys a tip before I carry on with the video. I'm not going to be buying a lot of clothes. I was going to. Why am I going to be buying clothes in like size 16 and, and size 18 and size whatever and I'm going to be losing weight? Just show you guys just in case. The jeans are a size 14 and the top is a size 16. Okay? But the top, even if I lose weight, I could still wear it because of the type of material it is. So those are the two items I got from New Look. I got this brown belt as well. And I spent like 37 something on my new look card. So that's not bad. From Tesco, I got these briefs. I went to JD and I picked up some trainers. I picked these up for Kaylan's birthday, to be honest. And I thought, oh, I'm going on holiday, so they will come in handy. And they're just some Adidas originals. I never really wear Adidas anyway. They're kind of dirty because obviously I was wearing them outside. I'm going to clean it up, guys. Don't worry. But this is what they look like. So these will go with like almost anything. If I'm wearing summer dresses, summer skirts, I could wear these trainers. I picked up the crepe protect, but I forgot to spray it on. So I'm going to clean up the shoes and spray this on. The trainers were 50 and the crepe spray was 10. So I spent... £60. This little lovely bag here, it comes with, with an attachment which is perfect, it's like a little beach bag. It's from Matalan and I just threw some bits down in there that I bought. Giorgio Armani um, perfume, this one here. I don't really, I'm not really a perfume girl, I'm not saying I wouldn't wear perfume if someone gives me but it, it won't be the first thing I go out and get. But I've got this and this is going on holiday with me. I didn't buy it for holiday but I just treated myself to it because I never get nothing for myself. From Matalan, I got this lovely top. I wore it for Kaylan's birthday because I don't have clothes. So this is what the top looks like. I washed it, obviously. It was originally bought for my holiday. I think this is a size 16 from Matalan. I don't... 
I don't even know where the bloody tag is, okay? Okay, here we go. It's a size 16 from Matalan and it, it's really, really nice. I think it would fit me better as well once I lose down weight, but it's nice. And like I said, it's a big top, but this I could re-wear. Like when I'm shopping, I look for stuff that even when I lose weight, I could still wear it. And this is one of them. I like the fact that it's flowy and long and I could wear that with jeans. So I got these nice little shorts and they've got the frill on it, the little flare, which I think is absolutely adorable. And these are size 14 guys, okay? Let me show you size 14 because some of you might be thinking I'm not wearing my size. They're elasticated, okay? So obviously they fit. This is also a size 14 and this is what this color looks like. So these with white vest or even a mustardy color vest and this one with a white or red. You guys are gonna see me wearing these twice. So that's two outfits, two days. Two days with different tops. I'm telling you guys now because when you see my vlogs, I'll be in them. I'm not traveling heavy because I'm a person that overpack and I'm not doing it. I'm trying to get out of that sort of overpacking thing. If I want to travel, I have to learn how to pack. I got these cute black leggings and these are in a size 14. And um, I forgot to tell you guys the prices. I don't, I don't really know, guys. Yeah, um, it's already 28 minutes. This is size 14. These leggings were 10 pounds, but they were so worth it. I love, love the way they fit. Guys, the ankle sold me. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Let me put it on my hand. That sold me. It's really cute. Once again, this will be weird. Two, two or three times with different tops. So that's already, you know, four, five, six. That's already six outfits. I'm just being smart. I'm being smart because what will end up happening is I will spend hundreds of pounds to go on holiday, come back, lose down all the weight, have all these clothes that I'm going to donate to charity. Nah, bruv. And then I've got this nice dressy one, similar to the ones I've just showed you, but this one is a different material and it's got a zip instead of an elasticated waist. But it's really dressy. This one's a size 16, obviously because it's not an elasticated waist. But it's really dressy with the flare bottoms as well. This with a nice um, white tee. And possibly a blazer or something would be really, really cute. And that's all that's there. This bag is coming with us and we're going to be using this on our days out. Because it's just easy to chuck everything in it. Have my little backpack on my back and chuck everything in this for Kaylan. So that, you know, I don't have to be pogging around with stuff in my hand. It's getting a bit crazy now. I bought these slippers. Now, if you know about these slippers, this is how inside of them go. These were from Matalan. They go like this. I've been wearing them to break them in because the back of these always hurt your feet. My friend has got some from Next. Her mom's got the Birkenstock ones as well and they go like this on the inside. So guys, I don't have dirty foot. It's just how these particular shoes are. I've got these nude colors. I wore them to break them in because obviously I don't want to be on holiday hopping around in nothing. This is for travel. This is going to be one of the activities on the plane for Kaylan. Once again, it's a PJ mask um, travel activity sticker tube. And I love the fact that you could put everything back in the tube. And this was from Aldi. You would have seen this in a haul. I showed you guys this earlier, just some little travel parts. Matalan online. I did buy a lot of stuff from Matalan online, but when they came, I didn't like how they looked, so I sent them back. I got these little slippers. These are like pool. I think they call them the poolside slippers and I think these were on sale for three pounds and these are the black ones and what I love about these I'm gonna wear these yes when I go I don't think I've got two but I'm not gonna carry all two I'm not gonna be that I probably carry this one but this is gonna be perfect for when I go to the Caribbean because when you're walking on the hot sun I had the shoes similar to what I just showed you guys I had some of these from Primark and I was walking on the beach in them and they get mashed up quick. So these are heavy duty shoes, you see? Heavy duty shoes. And they're plastic, so they're waterproof. Okay, let's get rid of the hangers. Okay. Plastic. More plastic. Now I got this little roll to take with me. And the reason why I'm taking the robe is because I don't know if it's going to be chilly in the morning. If I want to go outside, I have a like, nice little cup of tea. And I want to throw something on real quick to look presentable in the house and stuff. I'm not looking like, you know, 
who are you, what are you doing? I picked up this little dressing gown from Matalan. It's not really my favorite color and it's got a little strap there. It doesn't fit me perfect. Obviously, when I lose down weight, it will fit. And this would be sort of like my little travel robe, guys. Let me lift it up a bit for you guys so you can see. So you can sort of see where it drops, okay? You can see where it drops. And then, obviously, you just tie it. The color's not too bad, to be honest. This is going to be my travel robe because it's lightweight compared to the other robes I have. They're heavy. This charcoal hoodie... I'll be wearing this to go and to come back because you know sometimes the plane just be really cold. I love the way how this feels. I'm not going to try it on guys but I love the fact that it's long. I'm going to put this on with some workout leggings and this is my travel outfit to go and come because I'm serious about traveling light. It was £12 and I got it for, how much did I say? £6 so half off. And those are the bits that I got from Matalan. No, I'm lying. I've got this utility utility parker i bought this at original price of 30 pound went back online and saw it for 15 pound and i went for it i showed you guys this on my instagram this is what it looks like it's a utility parker it's really lightweight but let me show you guys what i love about it hold on right i love the color i love the way it um flares out so you zip it up you draw in the strings if you want to. And it's got that sort of flare. Do you see like flare look to it? So it looks really, really cute. Really, really trendy for autumn. You know, if you don't want to have a heavy jacket, you could pull the sleeves up using these. Pull them up tight and then you don't have to wear it full length. You could wear it quarter length. It's gorgeous, guys. Let me, let me show you guys. It's gorgeous and it's not long. It's not tight, it's not restrictive. It's got the hood. Obviously, I've got a puff on my head, so the hood's gonna look silly, but I'm gonna be having braids, cane rows. So if it's raining, I pop this on. And if I'm not mistaken, I think it's water and weather resistant. You know what I mean? So this is what this looks like. If you guys have made it this far, well, big up the video. Some videos you can't rush, you can't rush them. This is another activity from Subway for Kaylan to take on the plane. And it's just these little card things. I'll take them on the plane just to keep it entertained. This was free from, you, well not free, you bought, you, got, you bought your meal, so technically it's not free. Now we've got another Matalan bag. If you're familiar with Matalan, this is Click and Collect. I bought these jelly shoes here. Now, I don't really like how these look on my feet, but I don't know if it's because my feet swollen, but they're size 7 to 8, okay? And I'm a size 8. So I've got these little jelly shoes. That's what they look like. So I've got the clear slides. But I'm not going to take two pairs because they're quite heavy. But I'll be traveling more. I've got these little goggles for Kaylan. I don't remember. Oh, these were four pounds. Okay, I got these because my friend has a swimming pool and I got this way before we even knew we were going on holiday. I got this, but I bought this for us to go Jamaica because I wanted to go Jamaica next year, but we'll see. So I bought this. So we've got that and I got these shoes guys. Now these shoes, where is the ticket? Okay, these, oh, the price isn't on it. I got these shoes, I think, for either three or five pounds or something like that. And these are cute. These are going to go with me. These are the only pair of heels I'm going to be taking. Okay, because heels are heavy. And my suitcase is not very big, so I don't even know how I'm going to manage. I, I did order packing cubes, but I don't have a different video for you guys to see those ones. So I did order these. They're cute as heck. I just feel like this bit is going to kind of cut into my toe. You know, sometimes when you wear these kind of shoes, they kind of cut into your toe. I feel like that will happen. Hopefully it doesn't. But these are freaking cute. I tried them on with some jeans. They look hot. That's it, guys, for all of the holiday bits. Oh, 38 minutes. I'll try to edit this down, see how much I can get it down by. But if not... Enjoy the bloody video, innit? Just enjoy the video. Enjoy the thing.
So that's it guys. Like I said, all of these weren't bought in one go. I had them all in bags in my room, like all, all in bags I just bought and put down. Some stuff I'm returning. But these shoes, I'm not returning. I was gonna return them, but I'm not returning them because if I'm going to my homeland and stuff, these are perfect for the beach. I'm not gonna lie to you. These would be perfect for the beach because them other slippers, they got messed up, but these could handle the water, the hot sun, everything. So I've got two pairs and all of these holiday stuff, these shoes, I'm gonna, you guys will see how I organize my house. I'm not gonna tell you guys everything. I want you guys to come back and see, but I'm gonna be organizing my holiday stuff. So the stuff that I'm taking on holiday, I think they will stay remain holiday stuff, to be honest, apart from maybe a few. So, catch you guys in the next video. Thumbs up the video if you stayed all the way to the end, if you enjoyed it. Um, let me know if you and your family are going on holiday. I know I did say I, was, I will film a video for you guys to let you guys know how Kaylin and I um, afford to travel and will be affording to travel and all that good stuff, but that video will be coming possibly when we get back from a holiday or maybe I will try to film it while I'm there. I'm not sure. If I'm being repetitive, I am really, really sorry, but I am trying to get these videos out to you guys so I could edit them and get them scheduled and up so you guys have got things to watch while we are away for two beautiful weeks, living it up, getting tan, eating good, losing weight, and possibly finding me a little French boo thing, you know? Mm-hmm. Bye. <laughs> hey guys, so I forgot to include these beautiful earrings as a part of my holiday haul. So I've got these ones, which are three pounds from Tesco. Um, it's got a bit of threading and it's gold, gold plated. Then I got these dangly, lovely ones, also from Tesco's and these were five pounds. So I got these two and with the way, with the hairstyle I'm going for, these will be perfect to jazz up the outfit. I won't need to have necklaces or anything because the earrings alone are doing, you know, the most. I know I'm crazy but this is all I have for you.